Hi guys, uh, welcome to another video from the Crypto Gurus. Uh, the objective uh, for today's uh, video is to do a review of Repux, and uh, this is a very interesting ICO and personally uh, close to me because I am myself a machine learning enthusiast. So I am very well aware of the problems uh, facing the machine learning and analytics industry. Um, so I am hopeful that I'll give be able to give you some additional insight apart from the usual. Uh, on this particular ICO, so, uh, so we are going to. Uh, this is the agenda for the video. We will try to understand what is Repux, what are the major achievements that is uh, had been attained attained by the ICO until now. Uh, we'll talk about the team. Uh, we'll then look at the use case scenarios for the project. Uh, we're going to look at the media verdict followed by roadmap token structure and why should somebody invest into this ico so the simple problem that uh, repux is solving is uh, can be very easily very easily explained so if you were to talk about data and analytics and machine learning uh, there is a lot of uh, desynchronized approach that is being deployed when these things are executed currently so you have a lot of unorganized and organized sector generating data uh, which pa only part of which is utilized by developers to come up with uh, machine learning algorithms to solve problems using this data and to train their machine learning models so way the, the, the typically a machine learning uh, model would work in this way that uh, on the basis of historic data which is collected over a period of 5 years, 10 years, uh, they create statistical or machine learning models uh, which are trained to perform in a certain way on the basis of historic data. And based on the historic data, when new inputs are given to these models, they come up with a predictive solution for future. So for example, uh, let's say if I'm doing a business and my business has three variables, working capital, uh, market outstanding and uh, let's say number of customers. These are the three uh, parameters which are affecting my business. Now this can, the, the number of factors and what are those factors can be identified with the help of my historic understanding uh, of the business and with the help of historical analysis. Uh, when I understand, you know, when I establish some correlations or do a logistic regression or any kind of machine learning algorithm, uh, I establish that there is some degree of relation between these factors which give me a final output, which is my profit or my revenue. So, so now I tr train a model based on my historic figures and give them as input the, my future expected input variables and based on which I get to know what my future performance is going to be. So that is how a typical model works. Now what are the problems facing the industry? The problems facing are that one is that there is a lot of data available in the market but it is not utilized because it, it goes unused because it has no market value and nobody would give you your, their data for free. Second is their developers do not have access to business whom these machine learning models or data plus data can be sold to. So now the problem is at two ends. One is that the data cannot be consumed or monetized. And even if it is, then it then the final outcome cannot be uh, monetized. So Repux is at the heart of this problem and has cracked it by creating a whole new ecosystem where developers get data, they pay for data, they use their machine learning programming skills and uh, statistics to train models using this data and create outputs and they sell the solution the machine learning models to business enterprises on the same platform which is again one side of Repux. So that is in essence what Repux is trying to do. So I think I have been I have made an attempt to explain to you very clearly what Repux is trying to do and I won't spend more time on this slide here. So the the major achievement that Reach Repux has achieved until now is that one is that the platform is live and usable. So you can 
uh, check the link out in the brackets and uh, you know you can go to this link and uh, check the platform for yourself uh, they have signed up three pilot companies that collectively represent a reach of millions of small and medium enterprises right so these three companies are uh, the business enterprises that i was talking about so they already have a functioning portal where they have both ends of the story and they are very close to building the whole ecosystem now coming back to uh, coming to the uh, important aspect because this is machine learning and this is serious stuff so we have and they have a team which is very serious and uh, very well versed with the technology that they are working on so the ceo himself is a phd in statistics and you know is a pioneer in cryptocurrency so affiliation has a strong affiliation with mit and cambridge so the ceo has a very strong credentials uh, so has the other two members the core members of the team now i am going to now talk about the use case scenarios so repux data helps an amazon seller determine optimal time to send coupon right so that is one use case scenario which has already been done by repux second is repux could help the smithsonian monetize their dusty data so a lot of uh, smith small hotels and you know a small enterprises have lots of data which they collect over a period of time through their customer check in etc this data can now be utilized and you know can be used to uh, study the uh, usage behavior or the consumer behavior of individuals and can then be recorded into a central repository into a big data warehouse so that is again made possible by repux uh now with this analysis and with the training of learning learning model it is possible to recover 80% of the lost revenue for a company like artik so these are the three use cases which have been implemented by repux so you can, you can go to the website and check them out in detail but typically they have been able to uh, save consumer attrition or revenue uh, loss they have been able to monetize dusty data and they have been able to help a seller seller like amazon to determine optimal time to send a coupon right so uh, solving a marketing problem a finance problem and a supply chain problem now media verdict uh, both harvard business review and uh, the economist have praised uh, the idea that uh, repux is trying to utilize so the best part is that it is integrating smes so smes which are until now untouched with the big data space have now have the opportunity to monetize their data with they can themselves get into studying consumer uh, pattern and you know consumer behavior and take decisions uh, or create products create offers uh, based on the based on what their customer wants so companies like repux are bringing them closer to their customer uh, second is obviously it is providing great opportunity for uh, developers to uh, showcase their skills which they have acquired and uh, you know create wonders with the help of data so that is the media verdict the road map if you were to look at uh, already uh, a lot has been done and the repux protocol is now live and uh, attack now it is attending block show asia in the month of december and in april 2018 there will be a token sale audit and by june uh, decentralized enterprise application will be permitted on the repux platform so that is uh, the road map uh, laid out by the team the token structure is uh, simple uh, the token sale uh, start at 6th of march and end on 5th of april uh, the token distribution will go into a development marketing partnerships and operations so that's how it is and development will take most of it this is a very technical solution technically sound solution so most of it will obviously be taken up by development partnerships will be crucial to grow business to bring uh, enterprises on board and to bring more developers on board so partnership uh, being one of the major expense head does not surprise me at all at 15% operation because you will have employees you will have uh, people working to you for you will closely work with clients with developers and uh, plus there will be a portal to run there will be technological innovations going forward there will be machine learning solutions which will be built so that also is one of the important heads and no surprises there as well so uh, this is uh, interesting so the hard cap 
uh, it's supposed to be around uh, 33 uh, million dollars and uh, the soft cap is around uh, 1 million dollars so i'm sure they've uh, already generated that money it's their uh, it's a poss- it's a possibility that they may, t- may hit hard cap uh, in the first 2 3 days of uh, the ic itself so one repux is valued at 0.20 ic uh, usd and there are close to 500 million repux so that is the number of uh, you know repux that you are looking at discount rates as you can see will keep decreasing so if you buy in, would have bought in pre sale there was a 50% off uh, from 6th March, uh, the discount rates will move from 30% to 10% in every uh, week uh, as the ICU proceeds. So, that's about the discount rates. Now, uh, coming to the important question of why you should invest in this ICO. So, the first thing is um, that uh, the working there is a working product which is already ready and which has already been tested. So that is one aspect which we always uh, give top priority to when investing in an ICO. Second is the concept is great. So uh, there is a very uh, strong ecosystem that they are working with. So uh, the the machine learning ecosystem has been built over a lot of period of time, but uh, you know not not many platforms support uh, the needs of individual developers and and small and medium enterprises both of which have been catered to by repux so that's an interesting aspect there as well uh, there have been amazing media and pr campaign which repux has been able to achieve and that takes a lot of will and a lot of confidence and a lot of uh, uh, you know a, a very strong and planned approach to do that so i always like that about an ico if they are good at amazing media and pr and they have a working product and they have great concept then this is only a plus so this is not marketing gimmicks they're just trying to market their idea which is which is a good thing to do uh, then they have a team with credentials so a lot of experience in the team uh, you know which makes it all the more interesting and then uh, there is greater emphasis on data in coming years so <laughs> I don't know what greater means because there's already a lot of emphasis on data and the analytics and machine learning and artificial intelligence going on around the world. So, yeah, but coming years, uh, it's going to even increase because you will have far more refined methods of using data. You will have uh, additional statistically advanced techniques to analyze and uh, draw insights from data. So, yeah, definitely looking forward to that and uh, the whole ecosystem of Repux revolve around data. So, you cannot ignore if not invest in this ICO you know so this this is how the ICO is so you can go to their website on repux.io uh, and you can also go to their white paper on the web on the website or through this link and uh, you know for more and better understanding so I think that's all about uh, the repux ICO uh, bye bye